This is a broadcast of SmallCapVoice.com, a financial communications and investor relations firm. SmallCapVoice.com receives payment for investor relations and financial consulting services that it provides to its clients. You should assume that officers, directors, and employees of SmallCapVoice.com or financial analysts mentioned and their families hold a position and intend to trade in these securities for their own accounts. This is not an offer or recommendation to buy or sell securities. Information in this broadcast is presented solely for informative purposes and is not intended to be nor should it be construed as investment advice. As in all investments, an investment in a featured company carries an investment risk. Listeners should review the company thoroughly with a registered investment advisor or registered stockbroker. This broadcast does not purport to be a complete study of the featured company or other companies mentioned. Information used and statements of fact have been obtained from the featured company and other sources but not verified nor guaranteed by smallcapvoice.com as to completeness or accuracy. Such information is subject to change without notice. You're wired in smallcapvoice.com. Following is a presentation of smallcapvoice.com, today's leader in investor relations, capital formation, and retail support. Now, with your online business briefing, smallcapvoice.com's Stuart T. Smith. Welcome one, welcome all to this online business briefing brought to you by smallcapvoice.com. And as you just heard, I'm your host, Stuart Smith. And we're lucky enough to be joined today by Vitamin Blue Incorporated. The company's traded on the OTC Pink Sheet Exchange under the ticker symbol VTMB. And we're joined by the Chief Executive Officer for the company, Frank Ornelas. Frank, how are you today? I'm doing well. Thanks a lot, Stuart. I appreciate you having us. Absolutely. Thank you so much for taking time out of your busy schedule to stop by and speak to your company shareholders as well as our listeners here at Small Cap Voice and for those listeners who may not yet be familiar with your company. If you would, describe the business model and market for us. Vitamin Blue designs, develops, produces, and distributes water board sports and hemp slash cannabis apparel, accessories, and related products. Founded in 1999, we're located in Costa Mesa, California. Our business model can best be described through three basic building blocks, revenue streams, key partners, and customer segments. Our revenue streams come from four sources, online product sales from our company website, vitaminblue.com, online product sales from our partner websites, Amazon and eBay, wholesalers, which include stand-up paddleboard shops and surf shops, and OEMs, stand-up paddleboard manufacturers, paddle manufacturers, and surfboard manufacturers. Key partners. Selling our products through Amazon and eBay enable us to access customers worldwide. We're able to reach customers we wouldn't otherwise be able to reach. Wholesaling our products through uh, retail shops like Jack's Surfboards and Infinity Surfboards, OEMs such as Quick Blade Paddle, Bark Paddleboard, and Tower Paddleboard, a company owned by Mark Cuban and featured on Shark Tank. Now, these wholesale and OEM accounts are industry-leading, powerful marquee customers. These relationships give Vitamin Blue instant credibility and status. Now, these marquee customers act like lighthouses offering word-of-mouth advertising for Vitamin Blue, and they are an important part of our future exponential revenue growth. Our customer segments. We serve two different customer segments, waterboard sports and hemp slash cannabis. Waterboard sports products include board shorts, T-shirts, board bags, and related accessories. We are primarily focused on SUP, stand-up paddleboard market, which is the fastest-growing worldwide water sport market. Now, two things have enabled the sport to see explosive growth over the last few years. First, stand-up paddleboarding can be done on any body of water, an ocean, a lake, or river. Now, second, non-surfers can learn to stand up paddle fairly quickly, usually in a matter of a few minutes. 
I expect to see this growth continue for the next few years. The board sport market segment is projected to hit $19.6 billion in 2017, as reported by global industry analysts. Hemp slash cannabis products include hemp apparel and grow tents. Now, we expanded into this hot market segment to grow revenue, profits, and increase shareholder value. All our products are about promoting a simple, natural, organic lifestyle. Outstanding. Thank you for that comprehensive overview. And listeners, it seems like it's a great time to be speaking with Vitamin Blue. Just go back a month and the company announced a record 2013. Well, those kind of numbers can only be achieved by an established season management team. So let's learn about that now, Frank. Tell us a little bit about your background and any other key members of the management team. I serve as president and CEO. Prior to founding Vitamin Blue, I worked on Wall Street as a bond analyst, a bond trader, options trader, futures trader, and stockbroker. Veronica Ornella serves as vice president and secretary. She has been a successful entrepreneur and business owner for over 25 years. The business model we've built has enabled us to sustain growth through the recession. Now, we have the business structure in place to leverage significant growth for the next few years. Well, now let's talk about some of the drivers for those numbers I just discussed in 2013. Looking back on the year 2013, what do you see as some of the major milestones for the company? In 2013, we expanded into the fast-growing hemp-slash-cannabis industry in order to add additional revenue, profit, and increase shareholder value. We were able to leverage our existing manufacturing capabilities to quickly take advantage of this opportunity. This year, we are in the process of building this business segment further. In 2013, Vitamin Blue received its first order from Tower Paddleboards, a company owned by Mark Cuban and featured on Shark Tank. We are really excited to begin working with the premier direct manufacturer SUP company. This marquee relationship will be an important part of our future exponential revenue growth. Well, changing gears from looking at the past, let's talk a little bit about the future. As you look into 2014, which we're only at two and a half months into, what are some of your personal goals as the CEO for the company in 2014 and beyond? For 2014, we look to expand our water sports force business segment throughout the entire U.S. and into Canada. The ability for stand-up paddleboarders to access any body of water, an ocean, a lake, or river, gives us a lot of territory to cover. What we're most excited about for 2014 is rolling out our new subsidiary, Vitamin Green. We are working with some partners on this, and we expect to make a more detailed announcement in the next three to four weeks. I'm very confident that this subsidiary will have a meaningful impact on shareholder value. Well, Frank, let's touch on some of that news that the company has issued recently. Vitamin Blue receives purchase order from world-renowned Jack Surfboards, a leader in surf and board sports apparel and accessories. You touched on this relationship a little bit earlier. Let's drill into this press release further. Go ahead, Frank. Again, we recently received and delivered our first order for Jack Surfboards. This is another example of a powerful marquee customer relationship that will give Vitamin Blue credibility and status and be an important part of our future exponential revenue growth. Well, that's a key phrase, future exponential revenue growth from CEO Frank Ornelas. We've been speaking to him. He was with Vitamin Blue Incorporated, once again traded on the pink sheets under the ticker symbol VTMB. If you'd like to learn more about the company and we encourage you to do so, do so, please visit vitaminblue.com. Well, Frank, once again, thank you so much for taking time out of your busy schedule to stop by and speak with us here at smallcapvoice.com. We look forward to great things from you and your company here in 2014 and beyond, and we look forward to speaking with you again as more great news from Vitamin Blue hits the press wire. Thanks, Frank. You're welcome. Thanks for having us. You bet. For Frank Ornelas, this is Stuart Smith saying thanks so much for listening. Smallcapvoice.com, today's leader in investor relations, capital formation, and retail support provides its clients with the highest level of service. 
our audio interviews are disseminated to one of the largest opt-in audiences available today. How? We at SmallCapVoice.com believe in aligning and affiliating ourselves with other leaders within the investor relations community. By sharing resources, each affiliated firm is made that much stronger and each client is served that much better. Our focus is to identify and provide the very best financial services and solutions available to clients and their shareholders. For more information about our services, please call us at 512-267-2430 or visit us on the web at www.smallcapvoice.com.